Jalen Creed takes videos that I did. I did not like those videos from the get-go. I put them up anyway. I got a lot of good comments. Um, but they really aren't. Um, it was just a terrible series of videos, in my opinion. I'm doing something much more concise, more to the point. And one of the important things is that I have a really good camera now. It shows good detail, and it can really show... Um, the finishes and show what I'm actually seeing myself you guys can see you know and I've also I've learned a lot of things since then or stumbled upon some some things some alterations uh, I would go as far as to say there was some misinformation in my past videos um, uh, createx is a monster um, it is it is so enticing it's so easy to get and I'm talking about Createx. I'm not talking about Auto Air. I'm not talking about Wicked or any of these brand offshoots of Createx. I'm talking about the Createx paints that you get at the hobby or craft stores, Michaels, Hobby Lobby. They're very tempting. They're beautiful. They're vibrant. They look awesome. And I know a lot of people say, oh gosh, you know, why can't I just use these paints? Well, you can. Uh, you definitely can on a model, but there are some very serious, important issues, things to know. I wouldn't say issues, but just there's some very important basics to know about these paints to make them work for you, especially if you're a beginning modeler or a, or I should say, a beginning painter or a beginning airbrusher. I mean, these are airbrush paints. You know, airbrushing is daunting enough in itself. They're easy to spray, I mean, don't get me wrong, but to actually function in a modeling world uh, due to the way that these paints are, they can actually make it really hard on you. You know, your results are going to be very dismal if you don't know what you're doing. Um, you don't know, I wouldn't say don't know what you're doing, I would say not knowing the aspects of, you know, the, the traits of these paints and, and thinning and, and getting a good spray and the adhesion, all these things that will come back to bite you. This is quite a series. This is going to be an extensive series. Um, but it has to be to explain these paints. They're that complex and they involve so much in using them in a plastic modeling aspect.